tomorrow's Cassidy's birthday and we were going to be in Disneyland for his birthday and he's really bummed because we obviously can't go because of the coronavirus so he said the only thing he wanted for his birthday was for me to bring California to him so I did the very best I could I'm gonna show you what I made so I transformed our house into Disneyland so um, a lot of this stuff I already had um, but like all this stuff I already had because um, you know we used to work in Florida so we had a lot of this stuff and so I just am putting it all to use um, there's stuff I made like this Disneyland entrance sign and some stuff I printed out and then over here is the Emporium. It's the store. And so when they come in in the morning, they're going to um, put on some clothes of Disney, which we already had. But um, So that'll be fun. So we can be all dressed up to go to Disneyland. There's Cassie's happy birthday sign. And there's a Soren candle we got a while ago. Um, we also... Oh... Don't mind my messy parts of my house. Um, oh, I'm going to have music going too. I've got to get that started in the morning. But each area will have its own music. So let me show you the first ride. This is Pies of the Caribbean. So Katie's going to get in this laundry basket, which is a ship. And then we're going to go into the ride. Bum, 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 bum. Pirates. So there's a cave. There's the fire. That part there is, you know, when you go down, um, down into Pirates, you have to use your imagination, but that's the part that you go down. And here we have our dog with the keys, some palm trees, some fire that's moving, treasure, and the Pirates skull and crossbones. Our guinea pig cage is on fire for sure. Katie's little house is definitely on fire as well. These things hanging down are stalagmites. Um, we're gonna take a little break from Disney for a second because we are gonna go to the beach. These are towels that I bought for us to go to the beach that we're not going to use anymore. <laughs> and a palm tree. And here's the ocean <laughs> with a nice sunset picture that we already had. And just repurposing everything. And here's some sea creatures that are living in the ocean. We had some sand left over from Hawaii, so we can touch the sand. And, you know, I love palm trees. We even have a fish. Oh, he's right there in the corner. All right, we're going to go back to Disneyland. So, you're going to go back to your pirates. And then we're going to go on to the next ride. Oh, and I have these vintage posters hanging up everywhere of all of Cassidy's favorite rides. This is the bottom of Splash Mountain. So I'm going to take you up Splash Mountain. So this is the beginning of Splash Mountain. And you know in the ride how there's a bear that's getting his bum dipped in water. These are vines and then the water and then the fox that's chasing the rabbit. You go down Splash Mountain tomorrow. I'm gonna let Katie do this in a laundry basket very carefully. You get to the bottom to the water and splash, we made it through. <laughs> um, and then there's the bunny that made it through. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go on to our next ride. So I have to be quiet because they're sleeping. But um, there is headstones. And the door says, Welcome Foolish Mortals. <laughs> and then this is what it looks like. So, this is the lady in the crystal ball. And it's really not a soccer ball. I found some candles, some spider webs and bats. My friend let me borrow her Halloween decorations. There's some creepy busts. <laughs> in the bathroom, which is extra creepy. You know in the, in the ride how there's like dancing instruments? Well, there's that. A creepy picture that moves. And a skeleton. <laughs> and then when you're leaving, be careful not to let the ghost follow you home. And the last part's hard to see, but every time we go to California, we like to try to go to the San Diego Zoo. 
So over there in the darkness is the San Diego Zoo. <laughs> I hope that Cassidy will love his present. Since we can't really go to Disneyland, I hope this is a great alternative. And I think Katie is going to love it. And I spent like 10 bucks on um, tablecloths and streamers. Um, all the fires tablecloths and streamers and yeah everything else I already have and I just made some prints of stuff but other than that oh and then balloons we didn't have that but yeah it was a super fun project hope you enjoyed watching bye